Okay, let's take a look at the potential relay and how it's wired in. Okay, to look over this diagram, this is your motor, which would probably be a compressor. There's your common terminal, run terminal, start terminal, run capacitor, start capacitor. Now, I've noted down here a one, a two, and a five. Those are the three terminals of the potential relay that are hooked into this thing. So five goes to the common. Two goes to start. The back EMF that energizes this relay, remember that coil I showed you with the very small wire on it, the back EMF is going to energize this when it reaches 75% of the speed of the rated speed. Okay, the last terminal is one. Now it's going to be uh, right at the normally closed contacts. So as the speed rises, this is going to open and the start capacitor is taken out of the circuit. See, normally when this thing is not running, power is available through the normally closed relay to the start to give the, uh, the boost. And as that back EMF rises and energizes the relay, then this opens. So that's the one terminal. That's going to go right to the start cap. So to kind of recap everything here, five on the relay goes to common, two goes to start, and one goes to the start cap. Okay, that's pretty much it. Uh, not much else to that silly thing. Uh, hope this helps if you need to try to figure out how one of these things works.